How y'all doing? Um, well, first and foremost, I want to thank God for um, putting me in the position I'm in today. Um, I've learned a lot um, in these three years at the University of Alabama. Um, you know, I'm thankful for Coach Saban and the rest of the coaching staff for um, trusting and believing me each and every day. You know, I learned a lot from them, and, you know, I'm going to carry that on uh, in my future life and what's ahead. Um, and I also want to thank my family, um, you know, all they've done for me um, to, you know, bring me here as a man and as a person. So um, I just want to thank them. And um, to my brothers, you know, it's been a journey all my three years here. Um, you know, the camaraderie that we built here, everything we've done as a team, as a unit, you know, finishing off with a national championship. Uh, you know, I'm just thankful for them. You know, I'm, I'm honestly I'm glad to say that I could call them my family. Um, you know, they always have my back for life, and I always have theirs for life. So, um, you know, I'm just thankful and appreciative for them. And, um, you know, since I was a kid, my lifelong dream was to um, play in the NFL. And with much thought and consideration with my family and prayer, um, I'm announcing that I'm declaring for the 2021 NFL draft. Hey, Pat, um, I, I, I sense a little emotion in your voice when you were making your announcement. How emotional of a decision is this for you? And uh, how much are you going to miss these guys? Um, it was very emotional, um, this decision. All in all, you know, it's a next step in my life. But, um, you know, I'm just going to miss the brotherhood, the camaraderie we have here. Um, you know, I'm just going to miss all the memories we built here and everything that we had at Alabama. Um, you know, I'm just grateful for the opportunity to be here. And, you know, I'm going to miss it. Charlie Potter with the next question. Hey, Pat, uh, congratulations first off. But uh, just how much did you lean on your dad, him having this experience in the NFL when making your decision? Uh, you know, I lean on him a lot. Um, you know, he's been through this before. You know, I asked him a lot of questions about leading up to this process. But, um, you know, he's guided me the right way. You know, I'm just very thankful for him. And over to Stephen Smith. Hey, I asked the, the same question to, uh, to Mac, but just for you, what, what was one of the biggest pieces of advice that an older player or, or older teammate told you when you first came here that really helped you? Um, you know, he just told me, trust the process um, and work hard, you know, even on your bad days and even on your best days, you know, you going to develop into not only the best football player, but the best man here. You know, I just took that advice and ran with it. You know, I'm just so grateful for the opportunity, like I said, to be here. You know, I learned a lot here from the coaches to the academic staff to the, like what Max said, the nutrition staff, you know. Um, they just made me the best version of myself, and I, I just can't thank them enough.